Praise the Lord, my beloved ones. Today, our Lord Jesus Christ has come with another prophetic word for us. And this prophecy for the year 2020 is an awesome prophecy because according to 2 Corinthians 9 verse 8, the Lord says that this year we shall be blessed with abundant of blessings. And this is the year of plenty of leftover. So there shall be plenty of leftover and sufficiency for you. You shall be filled up according to your need and you shall have more than enough so that you shall share it with others. So this year in 2020, you shall have plenty of food to eat and you shall have leftover so that you can also feed the poor and needy. You can also feed the homeless. So those days of fear of insufficiency have gone and those days of fear of providing on time have gone because the Lord says that in everything and anything, the Lord shall provide us with on time. And uh, even before time, you shall see that you have advanced payment. You have advanced things in your hand. You have advanced money, sufficient money for paying your bills. If you are planning to start your catering business, then you shall be provided with sufficiency for you and the excess of food that you shall cook, you shall prepare for others. You shall be blessed with more than enough so that according to the Lord's plan and purpose, you shall praise the Lord and whatever are the leftover, whatever is the plenty, the much more of the food that you are going to have in your catering business, you shall feed the orphans, the widows, and the poor and needy. You shall feed the homeless with that. You shall have plenty in your barns and it shall overflow so that you can pay your tithes regularly and you can help the poor and needy according to the blessings that you have. It shall be a sowing time in the kingdom of God. You shall sow bountifully because you shall receive plenty for yourself and you shall store plenty and apart from that you shall have more than enough to share it with others the blessings of the marriage this year you shall have a grand wedding where you shall be provided for your wedding for your guests and even for those who come to help you in the wedding you shall also help others in their wedding ceremony you shall start a new business, says the Lord, and in that business you shall be a helping hand for many. Because of your business, you shall be a provider for many. You shall give jobs to many other women and many other people. The Lord says that you shall have more than enough love. You shall be filled so much with love that you shall even love those who have hated you. You shall love those who have ignored you. You shall love your enemies as well. This year you shall be filled with too much of mercy. You shall receive sufficient mercy for yourself and due to the abundance of that, your mercy within you shall overflow for others. So those who did not come to help you at the time of need because of the mercy within you, when they are in need, you shall go ahead and help them for the glory of our Lord Jesus Christ because the Lord wants to bring praises to the kingdom of God this year. You will have more than enough for your own home and you shall be a helping hand for building the home of others. Not only this, but the Lord says that for your ministry, you shall be provided sufficiently and due to that, you shall also receive your own storage and an overflow so that you shall help other ministries. Because of the Lord's grace that is sufficient for us, we shall be like Jesus who had given thanking to our Lord, our Father, our God. And with thanksgiving, he had broken the loaves and he had fed 4,000 men, women and children. And moreover, he had 12 baskets of leftovers. So we shall be seeing ourselves in this phase where we shall have leftovers in our life. So this is the year of receiving the sufficiency, receiving the needful, storing for a need and then overflowing for sharing it with others. So we shall have more than enough. We shall have much more blessings. We shall have abundant blessings in 2020. All praises and glory to our Lord Jesus Christ.
My beloved ones, if you have been led by the Holy Spirit to this prophetic channel, then subscribe to it and press the notification bell icon to receive the daily prophetic anointing. We thank all those who are honoring the Lord with their wealth and for all the offerings. We bless you with a hundredfold of return. My beloved ones, if you have not yet received our Lord God Jesus Christ, if you have not yet received the Holy Spirit, we shall pray a small prayer because this repentance is at hand. Our Father in heaven, we come into your presence to our Lord Jesus Christ. And today we receive salvation. We receive Holy Spirit into our heart. Oh Lord, forgive us our sins and help us to be born again. We shall seek you, O Lord Jesus Christ, unto Zion. In Jesus' mighty name, Amen. My beloved ones, with this small prayer of repentance, your sins are forgiven and you have received Holy Spirit within you. You shall walk the walk of righteousness.